G'day, you rotten lot. Welcome back to the channel. Thank you for tuning in today. Now, every now and again, just every so often, you get a bit of gear that comes along and gets dropped off for you uh, in the mail, and it really surprises you. And this is one of them. This is the Sonic Cake Amp Toast, or Sonic Cake Toast Amp list of features. Now, on the front panel here, there is um, two two and a half inch speakers. On the top panel, there are six different amp models to choose from. There is two different lots of modulation, so there's a chorus and a tremolo. There's two lots of reverb, uh, which is a room and a plate. And there are two lots of uh, delays to choose from, which are digital and analog. Uh, it's also got the standard uh, tone knob and the gain knob. Now it also has a drum machine built in and a tuner and you can use it as a Bluetooth speaker. Now, you can actually run this thing off batteries, believe it or not. You can run it off nine volts, um, the same nine volts that you would run a standard Boss pedal on. Uh, and you can also run it, power it up with USB-C if you've got it sitting on your desk, which is pretty awesome for dudes like me that use Mac and have USB-C outputs, outputs uh, ports everywhere, which is fantastic. So, I'm gonna take you for a little walkthrough. We're gonna go on a little adventure together. <laughs> It's got a little bit of reverb on there. Now this first amp model is the JC120, nice and clean. The next one is based on a Fender Tweed Deluxe. Lots of bass, slightly scoop mids, and lots of treble. The next one is supposed to be a Marshall JCM 800. Turn the gain up there, that's about as much dirt as I can get out of it. Yep, nice sort of electric guitar amp sort of sound. This next model is the uh, Vox AC30 Top Boost. Oh yeah, there's some dirt in this one. It's sort of got those slightly edge of breakup sounds. This next one is the PV5150. Now this is where things get a little bit hairy. The 
The tone knob is pretty severe, isn't it? It's awesome. PV future by future, I can hear a lot of low end in that one. Turn the gain right up. And this next one is supposed to be the dual rectifier. Well, you can just sort of hear the gain kick in as you turn the knob. some delay in there. That's a pretty epic sound. All right, now the last one, believe it or not, even though I said there's only six amp models, there is only six amp models. The last one is just a full range FR, FR speaker. I guess I've added that, so if you're using a little modeler or like a Boss IR2 or something like that, and you just wanted to get some uh, amplification for your modeled sound. There you go. The effects still work on it, which is awesome. All right, I'm going to turn these off. I'm going to flick this black back over to the uh, Fender Tweed because I like that one. Now, the way these uh, effects knobs work, these ones at the top here, is the more you turn it, the more of the effect you get. So all the way off is no chorus. Up a little bit is a little bit of chorus. Almost up to 12 o'clock is lots of chorus. Then you'll hear it flick over to the next. The next effect, the next one is the tremolo. And as you turn it up more and more, it gets faster and faster. Nice and slow down there. Right, now with the delays, uh, the more you turn each one up, uh, the longer the delay gets. So down the bottom there's like a slap echo. which is pretty cool. And of course, the further up you go towards 12 o'clock, the longer the echo becomes.
So that first one is the analog delay. You can hear that it's uh, degrading a little bit. Losing some of its top end and some of its bottom end. Round past 12 o'clock is the digital delay, which is just pristine and clear until it disappears. I'll turn that off now. There is two different types of reverb. Of course, just turning it up just gives you more reverb. Oh uh, yeah, this first one is the uh, room reverb. And the other one is room reverb. Sorry, plate reverb. <laughs> Much shorter. They've got the one they've got marked as room is longer than the uh, plate reverb. Right, so that's all of the effects. There's no other controls for them. All you can do is turn the knob, which is, you know, you can actually get some pretty cool tones out of this thing, especially if you're just sitting around the backyard or got it sitting on your desk or next to your bed or whatever you're doing with it. It's perfectly serviceable to get some great tones out of. Now we also have this. Now the drums have their own tap tempo. And then if you hold in the play stop button and then turn the drum knob, you can change the beat. So uh, you'll see it's gone blue now. There's heaps of different beats in there to choose from. Then you just hold the button back in, it's not blue anymore, and then it just becomes a play stop button again. Right, now, uh, besides that, if you hold the tap tempo button in, you get a tuner, which is pretty cool. Oh, I'm out of tune. I'm out of tune. Matter tune. It's always you, G string. It's always you. And now I'm back in tune. Now, this uh, Sonic Cake uh, amp toast does have one more trick up its sleeve, and that is Bluetooth. You can actually uh, use it as a full range Bluetooth speaker. So if you've got your batteries in it and you're at the park and you just want to put some tunes on or in your room or in your uh, sitting out the back having a coffee, uh, then you can also just stream music straight from your iPhone through it. And it actually sounds pretty good, which is cool. I'm not going to stream anything for uh, copyright reasons, but um, Anyway, there you go. So here we, there's a tiny little guitar amp, which is also a Bluetooth speaker, two two and a half inch speakers at the front, six different effects, six different amp models, drum machine, headphone socket, USB power, battery power. It really is just like I said at the start of the video, it really is just an absolute ball of fun. I've had nothing but fun playing around with it and um, I've really, really enjoyed my time with it. So uh, anyway, I'd like to thank Sonic Cake very, very much for uh, sending this to us. Uh, they did send it to us for free, but uh, they're not paying for me to say anything nice about it, but it really just has been heaps of fun to muck around with this, this awesome little uh, feature-packed practice amp. So hopefully, if you're just looking for something to chuck on your desk at work that you won't kill the whole office or, uh, you know, something in your bedroom so you don't wake up the baby, this has been helpful for you. Th thumbs up, like, subscribe. All that sort of stuff is very, very helpful to us. And we really, really appreciate uh, everyone who's been subscribing lately. It seems to have taken off a little bit. So thank you very much. We'll see you in the next video. Bye.